for EPW2 saving time, you may find Pythagoras' theory helpful to be able to find the length of unknown sides in triangles. However, Pythagoras' theory is only true for right-angled triangles. Remember one fact, that the right-angled triangle has its longest side opposite the right angle. And this is known as the hypotenuse. In this triangle, we know that our hypotenuse is called C, and one side is A, and one side is B. Pythagoras' theory says that C squared is equal to the square of the other two sides added together. So A squared plus B squared equals C squared. This theory can be used to find the length of unknown sides. Let's take an example. If we have a right angled triangle that has one side to be 10, the other side to be 5, and we'd like to find the length of the hypotenuse, we can write C, which we don't know, so we leave it as C squared, equals 10 squared plus 5 squared. To solve this formula, say leave C squared as is, 10 squared is 100 plus 25, so C squared equals 125. Now to find the C squared and undo the squared, remember the opposite of squaring something is to find the square root. So to find C, it is equal to the square root of 125. So C equals 11.18. You may find Pythagoras' theory helpful when trying to solve problems in your EPW saving time.